So we're in the northern whitefish range. As we were skinning up above about 5,000 feet, we were probing at the snow and you could just feel we have poor snowpack structure. Um, it's, a little sh it's a lot shallower than what we've been finding in other areas. We've got real weak snow at the, at the ground. The snow depth here is only about three or four feet thick. And um, as we stepped out of our skis to dig this pit, got a huge collapse, the whole slope fell. Uh, that in itself is a huge red flag that we're gonna be staying off of any slopes steeper than about 30 to 35 degrees. Um, we also can see avalanche debris uh, ran into this gully, so another big red flag. We're seeing avalanches, we're seeing collapses. Here's a slab avalanche that ran, looks like sometime in the last 24 hours. Thick rain crust that, uh, from our rain event a couple days ago, and now we've gotten about a foot of new snow on top of that. So we've got two problems we're watching out for out here. We've got these storm slab instabilities, and then those weak layers near the bottom. You can see here, our snow depth is only about the size of my pole. So we almost doubled the size of our snowpack here. We have a weak, shallow snowpack in the northern whitefish range. So we've got more reactive avalanche problems, um, both persistent weak layers and then this storm slab here. Yeah. <laughs> On the ground. Ah! <laughs>